personal yeah. and like and you got to know where to like you figure out where know the where, line yeah. is with that i oh i totally yeah. agree with you and That's so like reason... downstairs i was scared of that line well this is the whole reason that we hate sabrina's game so much is because she doesn't have a fucking well she doesn't line. know my number either which would be she would i think she would use it to her of course she wouldn't oh god it's not even like a I don't know. And I think that's why I took it so personally, because John knows more so my number than her. And so when he was saying, like, gross and all this stuff, I was like, oh, well, awesome. He I'm also gross. is drunk, so. Mm, I don't think he is. I think I am more than him. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if, like, gross is the is a word that I think gross is an that. awful term to use. Isn't it? But I, I do know a lot of people who would also think that way, and I think it's just something that just needs to be like. Yeah. That's really yeah. one of those situations where I really just think to each their own. Exactly. Yeah. No, exactly. And then I if agree. somebody disagrees, then whatever. It's just, it is what it is. And they disagree. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They're not gross for disagreeing. Yeah. More beer? Oh. For everybody? <gasps> no. Wish. Mm. Oh, that sucks because I uh, didn't. I say I'm like it's gonna be alcohol. Yeah. Yep. That's exactly what you like. That's exactly what you said. So it's gonna, gonna be half and not, like, and we're gonna get you're alcohol. Right. And I didn't make a hundred prediction. One of them was right. <laughs> yeah. My one and only prediction. <laughs> And by me, I mean That you. may or may not have been the reason you were taking out a second is because of your fire, your fired upness for alcohol. I hate you guys. <gasps> I'm so sorry. It's and okay. when I was out there, I was like, I hate it. <laughs> One minute, I don't care too. No, nah, what else? It's all And then good. John was doing that stupid thing where he was freaking you out about like talking. He was like, just look at me. Don't look at her. I'm going to talk. And she, No, I already knew that's what he was time. doing. That's why I was getting pissed off about it. I was like, that's really it. mean. You know, like, I, and no, I was like, No, the fact that I know exactly what he's doing is like. I was like, no. And I was, that's why I was like. He does that on a constant basis where he'll just sit there and like pretend like he's whispering to someone and just like look at me. I'm like, hey, fuck off now. Yeah, I'm like, yeah. that's enough. That's why I looked at him. I was like, I love you. <laughs> Don't hate me. No, it's fine. He yeah. just annoys me a lot. And, the then, and then me and Adele were playing like ping. I told you this. Me and Adele were playing ping pong for Oh, God. And just watching Sabrina try to talk game with John. Oh, God. Hilarious. It's like, oh, my God. It's to the point where it's like, the thing that scares me when I was telling this to Heather is, like, we know she's full of bullshit, but sometimes when she sits there and talks to you, she manages to make it make sense. She, and that's what I was saying from the beginning. Yeah. Because of, like, when I first came in, I knew she knew what she was doing at the yeah. beginning. Yeah. She has a very, very, very big gift with her persuasion. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. And I knew that. Yeah. Even just the first week coming in. Yeah. Um, but, well, because she fucking hated me the first week I came in, and she had me convinced that, I, that you know. Yeah. She, just watching her sit there with John, she told John that she would do whatever he wanted just to bring her further okay. and to bring her final to like anything. She yeah. will be his fucking gremlin. She will be his fucking like yeah. minion essentially. Yeah. And I mean, I get it. It's yeah. the only angle she can play right now. Yeah. John's not that stupid. Oh no, he came and laughed about it after. He's like, yes. was that a joke? Like, exactly. I just like, sit there for 20 minutes. I, like, I was there with Adele and we were like playing ping pong. We were like laughing the whole time. I was like, this really sucks just to watch her do that. It's like upsetting. It, it is though, but like, like okay, before, um, this was out by the pool. There and she was like explaining how she's like, I don't get how I'm made out to be the horrible person when they all betrayed me and blah blah blah. And she's sitting there and I know she's full of bullshit, but it got to a point where I'm just where I started agreeing with her. I'm like, oh yeah, yeah, what she's saying is making sense. Exactly. But then like an hour later I was thinking to myself, I'm like, oh my god, how did she do that? And and, and that is where I come from yeah. when it comes to like, yes, I switched sides and I'm yeah. happy about it. It was the right game move and yeah. I love all of you and I feel like I belong more on the side yeah. anyway. But because of everything she has said to me and everything that I've, like, all the moments I've had with her, yeah. I feel like it's hard for me to go against those moments because she had me convinced. 
She's good Seriously, at it. That's what freaks me the fuck out. And that's out. why she did so good in the first couple weeks. She had a yeah. her, her game is her mouth. Yeah. Her game was being able to convince people of things. Yeah. Unfortunately for her, she let her mouth go too far. Yeah. If she controlled it, she could have went to the end of the game. I think so too. But still, it still scares me to this day because I still see it and I'm still like, okay. But like when you sit down and you talk to her, she makes points and then you're like, oh, that's a valid point, but it's complete fucking bullshit. And that's why I've made a point of saying, okay, Sabrina's going to try to talk to people. Yeah. Watch yourself when you're listening to her. Yeah. She will try to twist oh, all everything. of us against each other. Everything. All of us. That's what I was saying. I feel like I want her gone before Ro. Like, I know it sounds bad, but, like, I want her gone before Ro because I feel like Ro is, like, book smart. She doesn't have, like, the... She doesn't have the social Yeah, she doesn't have game. the ability to last in this game without Sabrina there. Mm -hmm. And, like, sure, she's, like, more physical than Sabrina's, but then... It's against all of us. Like, I see what really you're saying. I understand about. completely yeah. what you're saying. Sabrina's I 100% agree with that. Yeah. Yeah. Sabrina's mouth just fucking scares me. And even though we know it's full of bullshit, it still it just makes more sense to me to take out that bef and rather than someone who has no clue what is happening in this game. Especially because, I mean, it's easier. Yeah. And sh at least Rochelle can be persuaded. I feel like Ro would at least come to the girls and just be like, hey, what should I do now that Sabrina's gone? So mm -hmm. at least, like, we could probably, like, be like, hey, like, maybe this is better or something. Yeah. If, but by you, chance, she but, happens what do you, to win. But do you think that the guys would be okay with that, though? I think the guys want Ro gone because she's more of a competitor. It's just, like, we shouldn't even be afraid of that if we've got this many people on our side. I think we should talk to them and see where their minds are at. I know Adele would probably, yeah, Adele's very, on, like, wants... Rogue on mm -hmm. first. Yeah. I feel like if I don't know. I feel like Ari doesn't even care. And I don't think John even cares. I Ryan think leaves. I think both like all like the guys in general. Yeah. Well Adele knows that Ro is more of a competitor because yeah. he is thinking of next HOH. Yeah. The other guys I think are just like hoping like wanting us all to get the final six because we all want. Yeah. Um but they just want the more obvious competitor gone yeah because they think that we can be sad which yeah. is probably true but here's the thing though is that if for some reason serena won she would take out the strongest people we have whereas if rochelle would... won and sabrina wasn't here sabrina or rochelle could be persuaded to take out whoever we want to take out true that's a that's a good that is also a really good point. I've thought about that as well. I don't know. Because, I don't because, know. because of because of the fact now, because Sabrina has made it very clear and almost like the game she's playing now is almost like I love everybody. I'm the nice person. I want to stay true and loyal to who I love. Yeah. Exactly. So if Roro came out of that. Like, if Sab went home first... Roro would be, like, a lost, like, Ro bitch. Roro wouldn't know what to fucking do. She would have no idea. Yeah. She would have no idea. And I agree. would actually, like, get her to the point where I don't even think she'd be that great of a competitor because she would have no idea what the no. fuck is happening. And she'd know that she's losing, so she wouldn't really try either because whether she tries hard or she doesn't try at all, she's still going home. Yeah. yeah. So at the end of the day, really, she, whereas Sabrina would fight like hell to win. Yeah. yeah. And she's smart enough to yeah. do it. Yeah, and that's the thing that I'm afraid of. Even though there's six of us and we're tight right now, yeah. Zab has this exactly. gift. That's exactly what I'm saying. She has the gift. It got her that far. Yeah. She's here with us right now. Yeah. There was the first five. All of them bit themselves in the ass. However, she she's was so the mad. only she one that was 100% gunning for these people. Yeah. You know? So if she's the only one left, she's going to do whatever she can to stay in this house. She will say everything to you, oh. to you, to me, anything yeah. to turn us all against each other and, and put a little so bit of faith in of her. I think that's so much more of a dangerous person to have around rather than someone who has no idea what's happening in this game but has like a more chance of winning a physical competition. Yes, and, and just let me put this yeah. forward right now. She will take the angle of the fact that any of us could take her to final two and win. Do not she forget has. that. 
She already has. She yeah. already drops it several times. She day. wants, she will use yeah. that. She knows that. She yeah. has dug her own grave, and that is the only angle she can take. She yeah. can take the angle of, I'm going. And hey, I'm it's a good angle to take, too. That's I get it, angle. absolutely. She is taking the angle of, I am, I can be the minion and just take me to final two. You will win. Attractive, attractive offer, right? Yeah. Don't let that fool you. I don't think it will. I, would you be on board with sending out sabs over? Because I feel like if we're all on board with sending sabs over, bro, the guys will agree. I would. Because I know, I know John doesn't have any strong opinion on who, which one. He doesn't care. No. Like, what? The only thing about Rose staying is if she is a better competitor than one of us, she's more useful to keep than one of us. You know what I mean? That way? But would you, if she stays though, I feel like the guys would still be gunning for her because she could still beat them and stuff. Like, True. So rather than them even considering keeping stabs because of the, like they can beat her very easily and they could take her to final two if worse comes to the, some crazy shit happens. So I don't even want that to be like an option that's even considered, mm -hmm. you know? Because if she's gone, they're gonna gun for Roro because she can win stuff. Yeah. So that at least gives us a little while. Mm -hmm. I don't know, just thoughts. I agree. I also just, I don't know because like, the three of us obviously know that Sabrina's gonna talk shit. Yeah. I know Arlie knows that. The thing is, everyone knows it, but she still does it. She's and convincing. Still, you're like, oh, okay, yeah. Exactly. And that's a dangerous thing. Yeah. None of us want to have doubts. Yeah. Just something to consider, I guess. But, I mean, there's still, like, veto coming up. Like, somehow one of them could pull off some crazy win. Well, really, it's if it's the three of us on yeah. two. But I don't want to split the group. I don't think so. I think if we voice this to the guys, I, I don't think that they have... I think Adele today was, like, strongly saying he wants Rogue gone, but, if, like, I don't know. I don't think they would be too strongly opposed to one gone over the other. Yeah. Do you think so? I think Adele would be very much for, very much wanting to get Rogue out. Yeah. Because he doesn't fucking care about Sabrina. Yeah. Um... But I feel like if Arlie and John agree, Adele would go along with it anyways. Adele's going to do whatever is best for the team. Yeah. Yep. I don't know. I, I do don't. agree to the point that Ro could win competitions better than Sabrina. Yeah. She could, I mean, but we saw small, like... <laughs> we did see Ro diminish yeah. the blue side today. More so. Yeah. You saw that happen. I mean, she, she fucking sucked, though, at the beginning, like... Still. Yeah. The fired-upness, the determination. Yeah, but then... We were at seven, you guys were at, what, two? Yeah, no, we were at... Th at three? three or yeah, three. Yeah. Seven and three. Yeah. Still, yeah. huge comeback. Yeah. I just feel like without Sabs there, she's just kind of, like, lost. I agree. I, I also agree that... Ro will do anything to stay in this game after Sab leaves. You think so? I think so. That's also a dangerous thing to think about. That's true. So. Hey. Sarah. Hello, baby. How's it going? 